For this replacement, you will need the following tools. An Imperial Allen wrench set, a Phillips head screwdriver, and a small flathead screwdriver. Begin by moving the powered down 1175 envelope press to the edge of the table, then wheeling out the feeder. Next, remove the stopper nut from underneath the feeder. The shot on screen was taken from underneath the wheeled out feeder. Unplug the power cable, then remove the green motor controller cable hub. Check to see whether or not the new feeder has an identical green cable hub. Otherwise, you may need to remove the cables and transplant them into the new feeder. Finish wheeling out the feeder. Now, you will need to remove the six screws which hold the feeder onto the sliders. They can be accessed from underneath the feeder once it is wheeled all the way out. Once the screws are removed, remove the feeder and put the new one on. Align the holes and reinsert the six screws. Do not tighten any of them down all the way until all six are inserted. Next, either plug in the new green motor controller cable hub or transplant the cables using the image on screen. Plug the power cable back in. Finally, wheel the feeder most of the way back in and then reattach the stopper nut to complete the replacement. 